Hi, I'm Kristen at Component Supply, and today I want to share with you a helpful product that we've developed for researchers. Our custom fab shop often gets requests for custom sized needles, but for those customers who don't know exactly what they need or want to test various gauge sizes and lengths, we've come up with a fitting that makes it easy. Our solution is a stainless steel lure to compression fitting that when used with our hypodermic tubing adapters enables users to adjust gauge size and length. To make a custom dispensing needle, the first thing you'll need is some length of hypodermic tubing. This can be tubing that you cut yourself, or it can be our pre-cut or bent pieces of hypodermic tubing. Then, choose the correct hypodermic tubing adapter ferrule to make the connection. Remember, not all sizes of hypodermic tubing can be used with all ferrules, so if you have any questions about which one to select, our hypodermic tubing adapter ferrule video gives more details and is linked below. Finally, you'll need one of the stainless steel lure to compression fittings. The female lure fitting is available in either a 1 16th inch or a 1 8th inch compression fitting, which you will select based on your ferrule size. Once you have your tubing, ferrule, and fitting, you can make your custom needle. We are using 20 gauge hypodermic tubing with a 1 16th inch adapter ferrule and a lure to 1 16th inch compression fitting to make a custom length 20 gauge needle. First, unscrew the compression nut and remove the metal ferrule that comes in it. We won't be using this ferrule because it's specifically designed for fractional tubing. Next, place the nut onto the hypodermic tubing and then slip the tubing into the ferrule, making sure it protrudes past the tapered end of the ferrule by about an eighth of an inch. Then hand tighten the nut. At this point, you can make slight adjustments to the length of the tubing if you need to. In most cases, this is less than an eighth of an inch, but it does give you some flexibility in testing with needle length. Then using the correct opened end wrench, fully tighten the nut. And now you have a custom 20 gauge needle. Now that you've seen how to make the needle, let's look at finding the parts on our website. First, you need to find the hypodermic tubing you want to use. You can view all our sizes and wall thicknesses if you plan to purchase the tubing and cut it to a specific length yourself. If you are looking to use tubing that's already cut to length and has been deburred, you can view this page. Remember, the tubing length can be slightly adjusted in the fitting. If you are looking for pre-bent tubing, you can view this page to see our standard bent tubing. Once you've selected your tubing size, view this page to select the ferrule size that matches the hypodermic tubing. Again, if you have questions about selecting the correct ferrule, please contact us or refer to our video linked below that goes into more detail. Now that you've selected the correct ferrule, you can navigate to either the compression fittings page or the stainless steel lure fittings page. On either of these pages, you can select the correct fitting based on the ferrule size you're using. Combining this fitting with our hypodermic tubing adapters gives you a quick and easy way to have custom needles in your labs and shops. You can adjust the gauge size by using different ferrules, and of course you can adjust the length of your needle simply by cutting the hypodermic tubing. If you have any other questions about the other custom needle possibilities, please visit our website or contact us by phone or email, and we'd love for you to connect with us on Facebook and Twitter.